What's up guys, I hope you all are doing fine and safe. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Tusker Vlogs with Sharon Zekria. This is the top end variant of the diesel manual version. So, you know, the first thing that you see in the vehicle is you have a beautiful front, you know, stands of the vehicle. This is the Mahindra logo in the front, which the badging has been changed to the front of the bonnet. So, this used to be at the back before. I, I hope you'll have watched my previous video on the first look of the spy vehicle that was launched. And uh, you have these beautiful halogen headlamps here. And uh, the front grille has been changed for some reason. This is more like a hard plastic grille that you have with a small mesh work at the backdrop. And you have the uh, you have the tar logo that comes standard in all the variants of the tar, just like how it used to come in the previous versions. And then you have the all new bumpers along with the you know the fog lamps in the front. Those are halogen fog lamps if I'm not wrong. And next up, you have these uh, new bonnet locks that you have here if you can see this is this is made out of hard plastic and this opens out this used to be different in the previous version of the tower where i have to pull it up and then take it off so that i can lift the bonnet up so this is more like the wrangler's design and you have a beautiful looking drl setup here along with the side turn indicators if you can see here this is not something that everyone can spot but this is something that uh, the tar the name the tar represents uh, you, this is actually, you know, is more like a synonym of the Thar Desert that is in Rajasthan and, that is, and the desert is what the Thar has been named after. And this is something else that is new. This is an antenna that comes outside, outside and it protrudes out like this. This is something very sturdy and I'm sure it's not going to break too soon. And I love the mirrors here because they are very wide. It comes with the Thar logo and the branding here along with the mirrors. The, they are actually very wide, very good and you know, you have a good visibility all around. The vehicle feels very wide. It feels extremely wide compared to the old generation Thar, the previous generation Thar that I have. And you know, I'm sure it's going to be a huge attention seeker. It's going to grab a lot of attention the moment it steps out on the road. And everyone is definitely going to be looking at the vehicle when it rolls outside. So one more thing standard is the same old Thar logo that we have here compared to the old Thar. It comes exactly here. So this is a disc brake in the front and you have drum brakes at the rear end of the car and the best part about this is it does not come with leaf spring suspensions anymore it comes with coil spring suspensions making the entire drive quality a lot lot better and comfortable what do you think Samuel? yeah definitely it looks amazing um let's see how it have how it does a better job on the road because we still haven't uh gone for a test drive in it you take a mask off so oh yeah i'm so sorry about that <laughs> yeah this is actually getting annoying <laughs> So yeah, we haven't got a test drive done yet, so we'll get to know how it is on the road. So right now we can see the car is beautiful as it's made from the factory made. Uh, 18 inch rims, as you told me, the good set of uh, coil suspension, not a uh, leaf spring anymore. The best part is it's not going to be as bumpy as yeah, before. Exactly. Yeah, that's the whole no, point of getting this, because I've heard the Thar is actually very, very smooth compared to the previous gen. Actually, and yes, uh, yes, if, it is definitely something that I would want to drive and see. So moving on. Let's go into the rear end of the vehicle. You have the same old standard wheel arches here made out of hard plastic. And you have the 4x4 batching here which looks beautiful on this amazing Napoli black color. This is the same color as my, my Thar. And I love the, the rear tail lamp section of the Thar. It's got the Thar branding here. I think this is also LED bulbs and this looks very nice, very sporty. And I like the, the rear bumpers of the vehicle. It comes with these reflectors. I don't know if they are, you know, if, if they can illuminate, but it looks very nice. We have a standard, the original, you know, rear fitment of this uh, of the spare wheel, and you have the rear door open like this. So this is very easy because the previous gen of the car, you have a small knob here which you need to press. It gets a little painful if it breaks and there's no go on opening it. So this is very much easier compared to the previous gen car. You just pull it out and it's very very simple and very very light. The door feels very light to open, and you do not have too much of a you know, hassle in cleaning this because 
This has a nice plastic covering here along with the opening at the rear end because the previous gen car comes with a small hook like this which is made out of metal and you need to pull that and that's when you you know you uh, the door opens for you if not you just have to jump out of the vehicle if you don't know how to open it another big thing about the top end variant of the car the 2020 car it comes with hard top as standard on the lx variant and you have an option to choose from a convertible top which i'll be showing you very soon and this glass fitment here is made out of dampers so which makes it very easy to lift it up and down all you have to do is open the door lift the glass up like that and you're good to go so the best part of the rear seat is though it does not have too much of space in the back though it has too much of uh, you know though you can see a lack of space it only, it only fit like a trolley bag here one trolley bag another trolley bag here if you want more space for more luggage what you can simply do is just pull this little uh, strap here and the seats go down the rear seat has completely flattened out which gives you more space now it gives you more no, uh, liters of uh, room for you to store luggage, to store your camping items, to store your tents, your chairs and all of that possible, your cooking items and everything. So both these seats go down just like this and voila, you have this beautiful space here, you know, with the front facing seats and you have an amazing area to accommodate all your travel equipments and your uh, luggage. Right, so the next big change in the all new Mahindra Thar is that the fuel cap has been changed from the right hand side to the left hand side of the vehicle and this is very much convenient because every time I have to go and fuel my vehicle I'll have to go all the way around and you know to stand on the opposite side of the fuel pump and then get the diesel you know, filled into the tank so this is going to be very much convenient and that's a good move Mahindra if you are watching Alright so next big thing is that they've changed the side footstep of the vehicle which looks very sturdy and if you can see all these grip holders here you know that's going to make it very easy to you know stand on and definitely feels like it's going to take a good beating because uh, I'm about 105 kilos heavy and if I can stand here on this it definitely means that this is made strong and this is made with good quality I really like how this uh, 5 spoke sporty alloy wheels look on the Thar because this is an 18 inch tyre and the 18 inch rim that you have here is batched with the Mahindra logo here and if you can see it up close the Thar logo actually looks very classy on this you know on this rim that we have here it looks very nice and i'm sure the, the way it moves on the road the moment it you know someone's going to look at it if i'm going to look at it i'm going to think of how beautiful it's actually going to look and the color of the rim matches so well with the napoleon black color we have here on the thar now comes the major factor because uh, we're going to talk about the pricing of the new thar in bangalore the on road price in bangalore so this we have here is the LX variant, that is a hard top variant and uh, this comes at a beautiful price tag of about 16.5 lakhs which is about a lakh lesser than the automatic variant, this is the manual variant that we have. Alright guys, so I hope you all enjoyed this video. This is the first part of the video of the walk around. So uh, this is only the, the exteriors because I didn't want to keep the video too long, I didn't want to keep the video too boring. So the next video, do stay tuned and subscribe to my channel if you all are watching my channel and my videos for the first time. And uh, do wait for the next video because the next video is going to be an experiential drive video. We're going to be getting the vehicle for a while you know, from Siri Shoto Mahindra at Bamnali. And we're going to be driving the vehicle around, probably try doing a small trail and see how it's going to be. And the interiors of the vehicle are going to be coming in the next video. So do stay tuned. So do make sure that you're going to subscribe to my channel and do hit the bell icon and tap to all notifications to be received. And I will see you soon in the next video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Stay armored, stay safe.